All right, here about this one. And this one. Oh boy, just these ladies. Mama used to go visit them, but they were always gossiping and talking about somebody. <laughs> and they sit down there. And they would talk all day long. When I'm leaning across the old picket fence, and my mama and my brother, she said, come on, Calvin, I'm going to take you back home. And he left the little ball right there, and he was turning around to get it. And mama said she was going on back to her house because she didn't like gossip. <laughs> they were, that was what they was always doing. <laughs> and see this one, look how she busy gabbing right there. <laughs> Busy talking. Uh-huh. Your mama didn't have time. No, learn. mama didn't like that. Uh -huh. My mother was a nice lady. You know, she was angel-like. She would tell us when they go to school, if somebody hit you, don't hit them back. Don't fight. We got beat up so many times. It just was pathetic because you had bullets, bullies, bully people. You know, but the little boys, and the boys were mostly bad. And uh, they would beat you up. And we had to fight me and Ernestine so many times. Mm -hmm. So I had a bad cousin named Ernestine. Ernestine, I paid a paint by Ernestine. Ernestine died with pancreatic cancer. I wanted her to live so bad. She mm -hmm. came here so many times to talk to me. And uh, uh, Ernestine stopped one day. We were like, let's see, sixth grade. Coming back home, I had little broke-ass shoes, you know, tied up real high to the top. Tough shoes, because they had to lash it. But anyway, Ernestine said, sweetie, let's stop. <laughs> I did something against Mama Will. Uh-oh. And I said, boy, Mama going to hurt me when I get home, but I tell her I fight back. But anyway, we beat those boys up. They never came back at us again. <laughs> that was the end of that one. You and Ernestine. Yeah.